Hello everyone, V does a photo to back with another review. This is the latest edition of the Zen playing cards, which I have way too many decks off because they keep releasing more and there's not much different with them. <laughs> I'm hoping that Conjuring Arts will come up with something new. You know. Anyways, this is uh, I guess the front of the box. You see lots of nice embossing and there's a black foil face, that's their logo. On the one side, it says the mask finish. That's a new finish. It's on a stick. The other side, first quality. Top says royal red. You can see it's embossed. And you see, the top case has a pearl essence type finish to it. It's got that pearl sign to it. It's pretty nice. The bottom says manufactured to exacting standards in Taipei for the Export Plane Park Company, New York, New York. And then the back uh, has that logo on the flap. It says Zen in that Asian writing, Japanese writing. But then, the inside of the top case, they put that logo all over the place. Could this be their next deck? A pattern deck? Like a B deck? Or one of the Madison decks? Except it's that face? I don't know. Hopefully not. Uh, then we get to the cards. You get your standard expert playing card company jokers, the J in the corner, the guy holding the cards, whatnot. And at the bottom it says expert playing card company New York. New York. You get two of those. And you get the standard expert ace of spades with that face on it again. Some Asian D looks like. And it says expert playing card company NYC on the bottom. The rest of the cards. You guessed it, they are completely standard, standard expert playing card company faces. Number cards are fairly standard, uh, fairly straightforward. The court cards, they got, they're obviously different than USPC, almost a little bit of a vintage look to them. You can see the finish on these cards on the faces, that the musk finish, it leaves a bunch of squares. Instead of just the regular little dimples. You can actually see lines up and down, like plaid almost. There you can see right there. Pretty cool. That's the same as the Lux Palm Plane cards that was from Legends. And I do like that finish. So uh, that's what you get. Oh, I almost forgot the back design. Which I probably flashed already. It is... The same as the other ones, with all the white details. And then, this guy in here, the face, the logo, is in black foil. It's a little bit of a weird combination, the white and red and then black thrown on there. But, it's not bad. Uh, as far as the back design is concerned, for this deck, you know, it's kind of just, you know, one of those straightforward decks. It's pretty nice. The black is a little bit weird on there with the white and the red but it's not bad I will say four and a quarter out of five maybe four out of five four out of five sounds fair uh, the faces again they're basically just standard so I'll say four out of five obviously usable for magic or cards or anything you might need them for handling wise Excellent stock and finish. I like the Damascus uh, stock and finish. It always seems to handle very well. I will say 5 out of 5 for this stock. I like the stock and finish combination of the mask finish. Very nice. Uh, like I said, if you saw my Lux Palm deck review, which you should check out, it's an awesome deck. Handled beautifully through and through, no matter how much I used it. So it's an excellent finish. Overall, four and a quarter out of five, I guess. Four out of five, whatever. I'll say four and a quarter out of five. It's, it is what it is. It's another Zen deck. This time they threw black foil on it. Um, they changed it to the tuck case again. But again, it's pretty much the same old, same old. And I just hope that they pull something out something new out of their hat of tricks instead of 
a different Zen deck because I'm getting a little bit tired of Zen decks. I'm losing the. Uh, uh, it just gets. Uh, uh, whatever. I'm, I'm going nuts. Anyways, that is that. Check out ClarkFellowPointCards.com. As always, use the code VJOSE32 to get 10% off your order. VJOSE32. And you get 10% off your order each and every time. Saving money is always good, so make sure you do it. And if you want to join the club, Vic10, VIC10, gets you $10 off the membership, any level you choose. So that is that. Comment, rate, subscribe. Let me know what you think. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.